succede durante no? Sì, ma non è, non è questa. Mi sa che non sono queste le porte. È quella la porta che... Sicuro? È una parte da è qui. numerata? Parte da qui, a tre, non so. No, non è questa. Ah, non è quella. No, no, no. E ce ne sta una... Ah, a me hanno stanno? sbagliato porta di rete. E dove sta? Viola, 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 viola che vanno di là e di che vanno di là. Beh, questi l'hanno. Ah, eh, no, 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 ce ne sono alcuni, ce ne sono almeno un gruppo di là a sinistra e un gruppo a destra. Ah. E quali attacchi e attacchi funzionano tutte quante qui le prese di rete, eh, Lucia? Allora pure quella deve funzionare. Sì, deve funzionare pure quella. C'è pure Però. Mia. Non lampeggia minimamente, hai capito? Questo qui. Adesso sì, adesso. Perfetto. Adesso sì. 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 Adesso Adesso oh, invece tu? la fa. Io scordo di accendere. Sto bene così. Come quando lo chiami il meccanico? Allora, eh, dimmi un po', vedi un po', dimmi, dimmi Massimo che dice. Oddio. Mi attenzione qua, ragazzi. Perché adesso dovrebbe stare già. Se noi facciamo così salire, però poi mi viene qua. Sai che possiamo eh, fare? No. Massimo, sei, ci vedi in streaming? Eh no, si vede, ma ti ho un po' messaggiato a... Eh, 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 ma com'è? Ma com'è? voce. Com'è? Perché più di così io non riesco a zoomare, per ovvi motivi. Cioè, si riesce a vedere? Sì, si vede. Ma leggi, leggi bene? Perché se no dobbiamo decidere, io posso zoomare ancora, però guarda, eh, se, se zoomo vedi. Zoomiamo, potremmo fare che zoomiamo sul. Però vado a decidere io poi cosa. Capito? Ah, sì, scusa, ma devo No, però mentre noi le, le slide le metteremo, cioè il corso power il PDF sarà comunque accessibile. Se uno deve, deve fare una scelta è meglio prendere il monitor con il terminale. Però come, come, come facciamo? Così? In pratica. Così leggi bene sul monitor del, dei comandi? E il, e il monitor comandi? Così ci leggi? Si legge bene. Sebastian, secondo te userai, eh, quanto userai il monitor dei comandi, il terminal? Quanto lo useremo? Tutti. Tutto il tempo, ok. Il tempo. E a quel punto registriamo, che registriamo il monitor, il video lo facciamo sul monitor dei, del terminale e poi ci sono i PDF accessibili e quindi uno eh, i PDF li, 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 li mettiamo insieme nella stessa cartella. Non lo so, che ne pensi? Massimo, sì.
Sì, sì, sì. Ok, facciamo così allora. Poi magari domani ne riparliamo, dopodomani vediamo se c'è una soluzione un po'... Magari. Non lo so, io credo che meglio di questo non possiamo fare. Perché... Eh, se fosse stato possibile registrare questo sistema di videoconferenza, però è un po' difficile. Va bene, a posto. Se ti serve qualcosa, se ti serve qualcosa Massimo scrivi sul chat dove vuoi. Ok, poi domani facciamo, possiamo ah, provare a fare un altro motivo, se riusciamo a, fare, a trovare l'uscita dalla, dalla tv, ce lo prendiamo il nord, ce lo prendiamo da lì. Se no lasciamo il posto. Sì. Adesso. Eh, non lo so se mi metto lì o qui. Perché io di qua non mi metto di qua perché così c'hai un occhio sulla. Non c'è mai Solo che effettivamente a questo punto conveniamo a metterla di là, vabbè ma domani facciamo durante l'intervallo. Comunque noi possiamo già, siamo già in fase di... Stiamo già registrando? Eh beh, sì. Vabbè, allora intanto eh, non se basta non ringraziamo quando ci fa il seminario, adesso il, il corso lo, lo consideriamo questo a parte. Però c'è un'informazione eh, organizzativa, la settimana prossima, allora, io ho mandato ieri, avete visto il calendario, la settimana prossima c'è eh, Mario Cirillo che martedì non potrebbe esserci, uno dei ragazzi, un dottorando, eh, e potremmo anticipare la lezione a lunedì, però lunedì c'è una, 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 una visita guidata, quindi dovremmo farla se vogliamo anticipare, quindi, a una prima parte tra mezzogiorno e luna, poi pausa pranzo e dalle tipo 2, 3 e mezza, 4, quando vogliamo. Va bene fare in questo modo, anticipare a lunedì? Siamo già più o meno si è detto con tutti, ci sono impegni? Io lo faccio. No, per mezzogiorno non c'entro più. Allora l'anticipiamo a lunedì, grazie, vi mando un'email al calendario? No, magari non di più. Ok, quindi la lezione di martedì prossimo è anticipata a lunedì. Inoltre c'è quest'altro problema della lezione di martedì 3 questo era già noto cioè il martedì c'è una visita il martedì 3 marzo era da decidere se anticipare posticiparlo o lasciarla lì com'è eh, il giorno 3 marzo hanno una visita guidata Fiore mi pare che è di nuovo impegnato aspetta non so se posso dire il 3 marzo eh, parlo un po' del 3 marzo perché il 3 marzo io ho sto impicciato quel fuori probabilmente io Uh, io da, da, non sei, sei tu che ce l'hai il 3 marzo no io però sono impicciato per, molti, per altri motivi vabbè quindi il 3 marzo sarebbe difficile a Vie abbiamo pensato di posticiparla al 4 il mercoledì però c'è un impegno eh, di, di altra natura con le alternanza ok quindi la potremmo anticipare al lunedì 2 marzo bene. va bene quindi ne anticipiamo tutte e due a lunedì la facciamo Scusa, lunedì quindi 2 marzo 9.30-13 sì, 2 marzo identica okay, e lo stesso lunedì prossimo lunedì prossimo che è 24, 24 facciamo 12 13 14 15 15 e 30 16 insomma quando lo vedremo sul punto va bene ok questa era un'informazione di servizio Andiamo? Sì, ci siamo. Eh, buongiorno, grazie all'osservatorio di Abruzzo e eh, Michele per avermi offerto questo, eh, per avermi offerto questo corso. Eh, il mio italiano è molto buono ma con l'aiuto di Google spero eh, parlare un po'. Eh, il corso è fondamentalmente pratico, inizieremo eh, la prima lezione lavorando direttamente sul lato. Bene? Questo 
eh, il content oggi vediamo eh, l'uso di python data types come usare logica la mat eh, operazione eh, con la stringa lavorando con la stringa eh, strutture di dati list top topless dictionaries and arrays eh, come scrivere come si dice ligere di, di, di data a un spot eh, eh, controllo di flusso eh, leave for while break and continue eh, la funzione definita all'utente corretto funzione definita all'utente mm -hmm. uh, come, come, come si dice in italiano running eh, Esegu run. eseguire come? eseguire 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 eh, a python com e eh, eh, come scrivere un codice eh, 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 commento to, eh, to be good read for, for you so cominciamo con la eh, console interattiva di Python questa commenti sola si conto per favore questo è un terminal normale o un terminal grafico? è un terminal normale mm. ma uh, non lo so in, in Mac ma, <ride> <ride> ma <ride> okay. è, è un terminal normale in okay. non sì, lo so okay. se, se è differenza okay. no, sembra so Eh, iniziamo Python con una consola iterativa di Python è una chiamata a Python ma eh, aggiunge iterazione con il sistema con l'uso di comandi di sistema variativo comanda automaticamente, storico e cc così scriviamo i Python 3 andiamo a usare Python 3 così eh, Python 2 2 eh, discontinuato bene so, lavoriamo con Python 3 il Python è una consola iterativa e il, il primo codice print eh, come si dice? virgola? no, come si dice? apice apice, apice. apice. Ciao. Python il primo codice bene per sapere come <coughs> pace e i comandi come si chiama in italiano il questo interrogativo. Interrogativo. interrogativo interrogativo e l'aggiuda dei comandi uh -huh. bene tu eh, salir eh sì, tale, volviamo e teniamo l'istorico con la flecchia di comando. Bene? Che po po eh, potremmo comandi eh, in, utile per la console iterativa. Questo è per eh, guardare l'istorico per esempio andiamo log star meno o 0 eh, così o è il nome e tutto il comando è guardato in questo fichero e, e so, ma è um... This um, is related to the working, to this specific work. This is specific when you I go outside, No, no, when you go outside of the, of the, of the yeah. button, it's a... Yeah. It's there. Right. No, no, no. That's, you see, that's a file in work here, in, in the console, in the... It's a file that you create, it's a text file. Oh, okay. You can review. Okay? Uh, log off, stop the history output. Uh, log on, re, uh, reactivate. Eh, history, show the history mm -hmm. 
Bene. Eh, y la variable, esto es mostrar de variable. No hay. En variable. Eh, y use, eh, la variable eh, expande más, más información. Un comando muy, muy interesante es eh, past paste. Uh -huh. Si vamos con códice en texto, procesadores de texto y queremos copiar, eh, eh, adjuntar en la terminal, esto eh, em, avoid eh, some problems spacing because eh, Python is very specific for the for the spacing. So I recommend when you copy for one eh, te, eh, text whatever you are using uh, and copy and paste here you, you must uh, use I recommend to use paste to avoid any problem of the bad identifica identification or mm -hmm. thing. Uh, questo è eh, questo è molto interessante for, uh, uh, for the time execution of a code line for example Very short for that, so <laughs> not ah, okay. so very short. So this gives uh, how long take uh, one line to oh. to tempo di processione. Okay. Pensiamo con le uh, continuiamo con data types. More uses uh, we have four, uh, quattro that, uh, the tipo di data in Python is non che significa no, eh, no hay assignment uh, to any variable, it's empty. Eh, numeric, que could be integer, flow up and uh, complex, complexo. Eh, boolean, que es uh, logical, true or false. Y stringa, que es uh, must be within uh, the quotes. Ok. For example, type show what type of variable we are using, type 2, we should show type uh, 2, is integer, 2 ponti float, uh, complex is with a uh, g, 2, 3, ok, esto es un complexo, uh, true, con mayúscula, Esto mayúscula, boolean o fal, fails. La prima con mayúscula. ¿Vale? Uh, y la stringa. Stringa. ¿Vale? Math operation. Son estampas aquí, pero the, the usual, ¿no? Uh, less, less than, less than equal, this is uh, for logical, so this is uh, for uh, comparing two, for example, let's say this is true, or cosine, true, true, okay, and no, igual, uh, for example, uh, or the, for the operation, the uh, or, and, and not, the, are the usual, okay? Let's go. These are the math operation, suma, res, uh, diferenza, uh, multi-product, uh, uh, divisione, This is the uh, the rest of the division division okay uh, remind so uh, this is the the quotient and, and this is the rest quotient the rest <coughs> ne, uh, negated or <coughs> the number 
This is like nothing because it's unchanged. Absolute, in, convert to integer, convert to float, or convert. Uh, uh, this is a complete number with this real part and this imaginary part. The conjugate de un complete, com, a number complex. Uh, this is a, a, the quotient and the rest, the mode. Power is uh, usually we you can use this, but the, the direct way, most direct way is the power x to the power of one. Okay, very simple. La priority in the math operation is the same, and we have a bunch of functions here that you can try. Out of them, no, looking that. So let's see some back basic operation. Okay. Is it queste funzioni sono tutte quante tutte integrate integrate non sì, c'è sì, sì. in no, 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 nessun no. modulo no 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 tutto integrato ok eh, basic operation you can see this eh, mm -hmm. okay. in, in, in python 2 questa divisione è un intero mm -hmm. ma in python 3 è sempre flow sempre flow ok so è un floor. Bene. E come mo this is the flow division. Discard the fraction part and this is the remainder of the division. This is as always. So, eh, a synonym of eh, variables we say with 20 ok we can make some operation like this, okay? Or put all together in one line with the tutti i virgola. Così. Okay? X, Y, G. If you make an error, for instance, um, okay. put comma I, 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 inform you that there is the problem. Si. Sì, pico, eh, po, eh, eh, because of the console, eh, I Python. Mm -hmm. Let's say, I don't know, eh, okay? Eh, it gives a, a very useful information. We will see this later. Uh, oh, queste, special character. Let's say that we have... Uh, Like see, this character give the last give the last num input number. Okay? You see? Okay. Solo per i numeri o per le stringhe, qualsiasi fattore. Tutto, tutto. Okay. Oh ah. no, solo so per il numero. Okay. Ma mm. Sì, su, su, eh, ma aspetta, aspetta. Sì, su, solo con il numero, solo con il numero. Il fuoco. Il fuoco di classe. Se si riesce. Al dopo. Ok. Grazie. This. Allora. Lavoriamo con le stringhe. Uh, questo è un eh, questa eh, hashtag e se commenta il codice e non se esecuta. Per esempio, we can say ok o si insertiamo così con la quotation allora because, uh, because we think string ok uh, we can print this print c o direttamente così 
uh, we can use single quotes or double quotes. Okay, single law. Uh, see, it's necessary uh, if we need uh, to print the the quotes like this. We use the the escape uh, command, which is the the slash. Okay, like this. Oh, uh, okay. So, okay, escape uh, character which is this, with N is the usual uh, new line. Okay, let's say, let's see. No copy. First uh, line, mm -hmm. escape character, second line. Okay. Escape character. Everything with the, the escape is uh, interpreted like uh, this. Uh, okay. We can uh, concatenate the uh, strings. For example, we can multiply by a number. Let's say we have uh, three times pun, uh, which is character, minus ium, uh, like this. Okay? Scribe pun um, concatenate. O così. Um, this is the same for the concatenation. Okay, if we have a very long string, una stringa molto longa, lunga, eh, eh, podemos eh, scrivere en, en due en riga, così, usando, eh, eh, abriendo. Eh, Con, con la eh, cuota open and close here, così, text, prima, riga, ok, um, prima, riga, due, aspetto qui, così, così, Se, se, eh, when we close this, the text is a si una única single error, okay? Okay. Uh, we compare <coughs> the length, show the, the, the length of the, the number of letters in, in the variable, for example, uh, four. Okay, word. Uh, podemos accessi a la posizione di uh, la stringa con indice. Word. Zero is the primo. Okay. Primo y cero y el último menos uno. ¿Vale? Menos due 
el segundo, el penúltimo, eh, así. Questo uh, are a chapter from position two included to uh, number two excluded. The last one is not included. For example, we will see here. Okay. This is our stringa. Python is the best. And uh, comienza in zero. And this is the indice 17. Bene? Eh, y si cominciamo del finale meno 1 meno 18 eh, questo es word tutti de, de, del primo qui es 0 al 2 no, no incluso questo es 0 e 1 ok uh, del 2 al 5 no incluso così y de, del 6 al final, eh, así al final, ¿ok? La stringa no si puede modificar. Si andiamo así, no si puede modificar una stringa. ¿Ven? Eh, Necesitamos eh, make a different one to create eh, to modify eh, modify a string um, a string we need to to create a new one for example this by using uh, say così Creamos una, una nueva stringa. Bene. Ok. Eh, using, eh, we use dir in any variable show a specific function that can be used with that variable. For example, let's use word, which is this string, and if we use dir word, show everything that we can uh, use with that word. All the functions that we can work with that uh, variable. Okay? For example, but also because we are using IPython, if we put our variable on punti y tabulador, show all, everything else. So you can navigate here and see what can. Okay? Mm -hmm. Let's try some, uh, let's see some of them. For example, this is for make all the letters uh, big, big. Uh, count the number of letters, uh, for example, ask if this is alphanumeric, uh, the stringa, uh, find some special character, in a specific character in the string. For example, use, try to use word count, word find, word index, upper and word replace, to see what uh, can we do. But the right. command is not word point, point count. Six. It's count no. in between no. bracket. No, no, no. The command is, for example, word count. We ask how to do and count substring. For example, count the number of P. One P. Okay, number of letters N, one, or O, così. Okay, try this one as an exercise, count, find, index, upper, and replace. Okay. See what can you obtain.
if you don't know how to how to work uh, with that, just uh, make, uh, ask for help to the console. Uh, if, if I uh, capitalize the library, the first one, uh, yeah, they want to yeah, only want that one. Yes, yeah, they want all in. Uh, yes, because you can see here we have capitalized, yes, but also we have here I think <coughs> uh, some which uh, only sh chain the first one. One of these only chain the first one, and there is other that chain everything. Okay, capitalized for example. This one, okay. okay. Only the first one. The company uh, is lower. Uh, is uh, what? Where is that? I can see. It's lower, but uh, you can try here for some. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. Thanks. So let's. <coughs> Capitalize, capitalize only the first letter. Si. And if you want to want to capitalize everything? It, no, it's, uh, something is uh, capitalized, is upper. Ah, I think it's upper. <coughs> Let me try. Si, si, yeah. si. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Upper, mm -hmm. everything. So we have... Uh, for example, uh, left justify or something like a, a strip or L strip, which uh, clean all the empty space before and after. We have a, a lot of associated functions with this. So. We can use, uh, let's count number T, for example. Number T, we should have three, okay? Uh, fine. Give you the first coincident, the index of the first uh, match. Match. Mm. This case is index 2, 0, 1, 2. Okay? Return the position of the letter. Si. Mm -hmm. Return the, the index. The index. Two. Or uh, the opposite side is the index. Index. Which return the lowest index in the string. Okay? Index. Uh, say is the same. Break, uh, uh, to find is the, is the same result. Upper uh, replace. Okay, this is interesting. Uh, replace. So we give the all new. Say we want to replace a uh, T with T. Okay. Formatting text, this is interesting. Okay. Eh, per lavorare con il formato text eh, usiamo eh, usiamo dei classical formatting. No, eh, eh, questo è il, il percentage come si dice? Percentuale. Percentuale. Sì, ma poi non c'è bisogno di tradurre i comandi. I comandi non sono gli stessi. Il percentage è S for string, percentage D for integer. F for floats with decimal like usual this one no mm -hmm. uh, like, uh, we have always used this one and E for exponential there is also a very an addition of formal uh, for Python which is G that uh, for convenience output is fixing the significant figure it's very interesting we can try that for example this uh, percentual point uh, 5G fits five significant figure. We can try, for example, let's uh, uh, define 
um, integer um float of and uh, an exponential. Okay. Now, uh, this is how is the uh, text formatted. The first part consists in two parts. The first part is uh, before this, uh, the percentage, uh, the first part is the uh, text with the format that we want to, to give. Everything within uh, the apostrophe, everything. Because of this, he is going to interpret this as a format and not uh, as a string. Okay? So this is a string. We want to uh, out the output like a string. This is integer. Uh, and this is a floor. Okay? Like this. And then we say to the print output that. What is ca ca coming now is this is going to this, this is going to this, this to the floor, and this to the exposure. It's like this assemble. Okay? Also, we can use here the escape character to, for a, if we want a new line or tabulation, whatever you want. Okay? Let's try this. Se non specifico il format, eh, per esempio nel digital, nel digital sì. lui eh, assume, fa lui un'assunzione. No, do, eh, no, è un errore, perché le spera... No, spera... gli posso dire, anzi, che hai type, no, no, percentage D5, mm -hmm. instead of percentage D, or no, percentage 5D. 5D? Yeah. Ah, no, uh, no, mi, mi, sì, sì, sì. Posso dire, posso sì. specificare sia il numero di digiti sì, come sì, anche sì, posso sì, 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 sì. il float, glielo posso specificare come sì. anche non specificare. Sì, 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 po posso specificare. Mm. Aspetta, aspetta, quello. Migliore così? Però, eh, sì, no, eh, non vedevo se c'erano degli apici o meno. Eh. Why it is necessary the percentage before the bracket? Because you, you have to... Oh, no, because the, the percentage oh. before the this bracket, one. this chart. Yeah. Because you have to tell to the uh, to Python, we end we have ended with the text, because here you can put, uh, for example, you can add uh, uh, join to text, for example, let's say you have a string here, and then you, have, you want to repeat this twice, for example. Then you have to multiply this by three. Think about you have 20 columns. You don't want to put uh, with the same uh, format. You don't want to put 20 times the same format. So, because this is a string and we saw that uh, we can multiply a string for a number to repeat. So you, you fix, for example, this one within comma and multiply it by 20. So you have to tell to Python in any way that we, we have ended with the, what we want to print with the format and now start the variables. 
which is uh, always within parentheses if we have more than one. Okay? How it's work? Was okay? Yes. Okay. Yes. So yes. let's try the, the G format. It's very interesting. For example, <coughs> uh, print with G, for example. Okay? Let's say without any number, uh, we want to plead the float. Okay? Okay, because we have only one, we need we don't need the, the uh, to put it between between parentheses. Okay, so let's say that we want uh, point three, only three significant digit. Okay, but also let's try uh, uh, thirteen point two seven seven four. Okay, so we wrong correctly. Or if we want more significant digits, it say okay, we have no more. So you ask for a seven, but the number have only five. Okay, so it put five. Because it's all it has. It don't complete with zero because mean nothing. Okay. So if we want a, a fixed number of uh, single category, no, no. Be oh, because it's rounded. You oh. ask for three, it's rounded. Oh, okay. Automatically. For example, if we want the uh, four here, this is <coughs> discarded and it's. Perfect and number is point two four five. No, no, no. I change here. Ah, okay, okay. Yes, okay. This is one. Change here. <coughs> to to see the round. Yeah. Okay. So this is interesting. Also, this is very powerful because Python has uh, the own pseudo language for formatting text. It's very powerful. Uh, so for printing anything with the required format is in this way. So we uh, use uh, between uh, uh, the apostrophe, we use uh, and the chiave, these two points, and the format, point format and the number. So we can do things like that. For example, this uh, with uh, this is uh, with uh, deci decimal, we, we want to ask for some decimal, uh, decimal with signs, uh, this is the same, uh, no decimal places, so this is the number and this is the output with this format, okay? I'm very interesting, for example, uh, if we want to uh, path with zero, beginning at the end, we can use also these things, but with number with zeros with this or with empty mm -hmm. this is left padding or right padding so it's very powerful uh, for ah uh, and also very interesting we can use uh, to place uh, variables for example if we leave empty here the the place and we will and we say Teramo is in format Italy, is going to put Italy here, right? Or, for example, we have two variables, it's, the first one is going to be here, and the second one here, in this position, okay? So it's very powerful. It's also very powerful for for fix uh, what we when we write uh, into a text file and we want always the same format with the we don't want for example to round we have we want to cut we would like to cut the number and around this is very powerful uh, for do that in writing text files uh, okay not the, not this <coughs> also uh, for example we can take it can take also variables. 
we say the cube of number is result, and there in format we say cube is cube, number is this one, and result is that, that is going to put one, two, three in one, two, three. As with the, it's going to, the variable q is going to here, the variable number here, and result here. You can try this last one. Okay, I understood the, 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 the meaning of this, but for instance, if uh, the, 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 the entity cube is defined in a different part of the code, yeah, so we're yeah. the sum, how I can print there? Just yeah, cube. You put cube here. Yeah, but the, the, the command point, point format uh, is specified there. You the can, yes, it's not necessary. Not necessary. Okay, if you want to put in, in this way, if you have in another place uh, the variable use the, the, the other one thing to plot. Okay, this is more like in, in that line. That's, I mean, uh, you, you have created that variable there, you want to pull, pull out. Okay? The thing is that the, the difference between... The thing is that the output of this is always a text. Okay? No variable. So you can try print. Is it working? Okay. Let's go with the data structure. Okay, so with Python we can arrange data using list for which several types of variables can be combined. So in a list we can combine numbers, which could be integer uh, or floats or complex, and also we can combine other list or strings so you can put everything there the indexing is exactly the same as in the strings okay so let's define squares like this this is a string with this uh, this uh, parenthesis and the index zero is the first one and minus one is the last one okay mm -hmm. We can access to a bunch of uh, numbers, <coughs> for example, minus 3 will be 1, 2, 3, minus 3, three to the end, so it will be 9, 16, and 25, okay? This shows everything, to double point, shows everything, and operation uh, with list is not mathematical operation, it's concatenation. Okay, we can operate mathematically on this. Let's try to do that one. For example, if we define square and then we want to zoom with this, what we are going to, to have is a concatenation of two the list. It's going to put this and this together in the same list. Okay? Mm -hmm. Let's try that. Uh, we, we can change the content of the list by manipulation uh, of the index. So let's try to change cubes, for example. So we have cubes defined here. We have uh, 1, 8, 65, and 1, 2, 5. But we make a mistake, I want to change the third position. That is the indices 0, 1, 2, okay? So, cubes 2 equals 64, okay? Directory, or we want to make also the operation directly. Cubes now is correct. Okay. You can ask, uh, add also items at the end of the list with append. Remember the tabulation uh, about. So if we make uh, we 
right cubes. So <coughs> we have some uh, tools that we can uh, work with. One is Appen. Okay? And we want to Appen a new one, let's say, uh, this one, uh, 2, 2, 1, 6. So it happened at the end, okay, of the list. Or we want to this one, okay. But we want this happen is up to the end. But if we want to put in between, we can use insert. So this at twenty seven in position two, index two. That is the third one because it starts in zero, okay. So cubes. Insert index two twenty seven. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's try it now with letters. The, those are number. Let's try it now uh, at least with letters, like this. Okay. So we create letters. Because our letters must be in quotes. A, B, C, D, E, F, OK? And uh, we want to replace some of them by capitals. We can use this, for example, we say between 2 and 5. Two, five. Uh, C, D, E. Okay? Now, we have replaced those. Okay. Uh, let's say we want to remove th that one we have inserted, so it's very easy. So what we you what we do is let's say between two and five equal empty. You remove, and you want to remove everything. We can do just like this, or just like this, it's point, okay? Now letters is empty. Okay? We can ask uh, what is the length. Now we can make sure list we have here a new list with contain one number, one string, and another list. Okay, let's say let's write this and let's try to access with index to any of them. 20 and another list. Which contain some floats. Okay, so the first index is the number, the second index, the string. The string, and the third one is the list, the full list. Okay, so if we want to access the first number in the <coughs> list, in the third, it was this one, two, three, three elements this list, but we want to access this one. 
So this is the third element, that is the index 2, and within this, the index 0. Oh, sorry. Okay? Second element, the, the, the index number 2, and this is the index 0. That's it. Or, we want to access the last one, which is this one. Okay? Okay. This is two lists. This is, this is the same example. We have a list with two uh, nested lists. This is the first one, beta, and this is the second one number. The first index is this one, and we want to access uh, this one is zero, mm -hmm. which is this one, and this is one. Okay? We have seen that we can concatenate lists by adding together. So we have uh, letters and datos. We can do directly letters, più datos. Okay? You take the first, and at, at the end, the second. We can operate with lists in similar way as a string. If we have, uh, for example, we want to print, we want three times this, we multiply it by three. We have repeated the same. So it don't uh, make any mathematical operation, concatenation. This cannot be operated mathematically, only concatenate. And if I want to write this, this uh, string on three different lines? Oh, you spring formatted. You want to mm. three lines. Uh, you want the string or want the list? I want the letter repeated three times on print. The Uh, S uh, and N, okay? And this, uh, this is more advanced because we need to put here, uh, we, 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 we want to go line by line. We can use a 4, but this is a, uh, you, know, you can use a 4, a, a loop, okay? But this is the format, S. Let's say, for example, the thing is that uh, this is not going to work uh, without a loop because we have different, uh, several uh, elements, and this is only one, okay? But a new line would, would be, for example, letters, zero, and the next one we can for do this for letters in letters print like this S N S L Okay So we will see how it works with the L so in this case, L is taking any value, not the, not the index, the value within letters. And, and here we print L with a new line, okay? Okay. So, okay, so we have a for, okay, so Let's try some methods associated to lists, like uh, this one, stars. Can work with uh, star, algol, <coughs> and neb. Okay, stars, tabulation, and we want some of them. For example, uh, we can remove uh, some of them. For example, let's say we want to remove one of one of these stars. 
So remove value and that's it. Should be work. Start remove. Uh, remove it. Okay? What happens if we don't have that to start? No assist. Okay? Let's try now a different type of uh, data, data uh, structure, which is tuples. Tuples. Uh, tuples are lists that cannot be modified. It works like uh, the uh, list, but you cannot modify them. Okay? They are defined the same way, you, but using parentheses instead of uh, uh, the square brackets. Okay? Or directly without any parentheses. For example, this is if we don't put uh, any thing defining this. This is two, mm -hmm. but also but also work with that. Okay. okay. Um, we cannot operate. We make, a, for example, uh, a times three <coughs> times three <coughs> multiply. A, a, we can operate like in this, at least as we say, but cannot be modified. You see, it has to repeat the the tuple, but if in the, instead of the list that can be modified, sorry, uh, a three uh, t can cannot be modified. Okay, let's see now dictionary. It's very interesting way to uh, order data. So dictionaries are lists where which uh, where each element identified with a name or key and uh, a corresponds uh, value. So in keeping is given by a key value pair. Uh, the key is defined first and always with apostrophe is a string key, and then the corresponding value that could be uh, any any date. String or number, whatever, even list. Okay, so let's <coughs> let's try to define the, our first uh, dictionary. Okay, look at this. This is in Kiave, open and close Kiave, and it start with the key within uh, which is a string, two points. And the value associated to the uh, key. So this is the same. Now this is another key. Uh, let's try this one. Let's win. Let's write this one, and we are going to work with this. So let's construct a dictionary. Kiave name. And now, oh, yeah. okay. Let's let uh, let's ask for the key. The keys. Sorry. Oh, 
sorry, no es no, Kale, es eh, Tato. So I show the, the key word. In un dizionario la prima colonna è sempre una, una stringa e poi posso avere quante, Qualcu quante keys voglio. Sì. La prima è una stringa. Eh, e i e string per chi cosa? Chi dice? Due poi. Stringa e tu poi è sta eh, le key. Ma then inside the di also number. Yes, anything. Yeah, ma ma la, le, il key es el keyword y es stringa siempre. Keys and values, uh, we can also ask for what are the values. Ok? Mm -hmm. If you want to access a specific keyword, yeah. we do this. Okay. This is associated this list is associated with key with keyword. E a questo punto questa sottolista, questa questa è una lista. lista, è una lista. Sì. Ma eh, posso facere un dato una nuova keyword, per esempio eh Okay. Of age. Okay? Così. Uh, no, <coughs> okay? Allora, datos, keys. Not that. This is not ordered in the same way you introduce that nothing to do, okay? So if you want to convert this, this is not a list, the output is not a list of the key type, is dictionary keys. If we want to convert to list, just do this, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, it's not ordered because it's a dictionary, it's like a database, so it has no meaning. Yeah. Okay. So if we want to remove a uh, keyword, just use delete command. Del uh, mm, okay, that does. And we remove only that keyword. Okay? Well, that does is remove. We have removed all the keyword. So we have con name and age. Ah, okay. We have removed surname. We want to ask if a keyword is in in the dictionary. We just say H in datos true. Uh, long in datos fails, okay? Or also work for for values. Let's say we want to twenty two in datos keyword H true, okay? Andiamo con l'array. Array is the very useful, the most thing that the uh, type of data of structure uh, that we can use in Python are list and arrays. Because use is, list is the usual way we are going to read data and write data, and arrays to operate mathematically with them. So to work with arrays we need uh, to import NumPy, which is a standard library uh, in, is one of the most used in Python and give the possibility of operate with a uh, list converting to an array. So let's import numpy like this import numpy as np. 
we are saying, okay, import all the functions that are in numpy, but with this alias, so we don't need to write everything numpy. Okay. We will go back uh, to this, uh, how the modules work and how to import, but for now, let's do it, let's do it in this way. Every, everybody has tuto, uh, tiene el, el numpy instalado, mm -hmm. No, it's M. M. No, pick. Lista, so for example, que con número, nueve punto cero, punto seis, nueve punto tres, punto due, okay? We can convert uh, this x, okay? Say because we have imported numpy as np, we say np dot array x, so it's convert this list to an array, type x, numpy array, okay? Now let's operate with two, one. <coughs> let's uh, create a, a new one with the same length. directly also make in this way, right? But because we want to we can use we can't uh, convert in this way directly also, okay? Uh, we can add together for some mm -hmm. now print now it was the the adding in math not concatenated <coughs> maths, but it's soon both. Not plus x, now it's soon because our array. Or we can multiply by three. We can do anything. And if the array have not the same number of elements? It's an error. It gives you information. An error. Uh, you can add a, a number, single number. But not uh, you cannot uh, sum two arrays of different size. For example, we can have uh, x plus uh, four, no problem. Or divide by three, whatever. Or divide by zero. Okay, no problem. Give no error. Give a warning and give you the number. Okay. So, <coughs> but what can we do is like this. Okay. The shapes are not the same. So mm -hmm. both arrays must have the same shape to be uh, operated. This is not a, it's different list. List, you can add together whatever number of, of arrays, of a uh, list. Okay, so we it works. The index works exactly the same like in the list or strings, be, beginning with zero. Um, um, for example, if we want uh, to this is interesting. For example, if we want to skip some index is like in this way. So this is element from index two to seven. Remember, the last one is not pick up. And this is in very interesting that the last one is not uh, taken into account because the length of the output is always the last number minus the first one. So if we say put everything between 2 and 8, it's going to give 6. So you don't have to be deal with, okay, we, uh, should I add one 
for the for the list or or other uh, thing because the output is always the, the number of elements of the output is always the last number minus the the first one. Okay. If we start with one, that is different. So it's a, it's a mess. We have to 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 add one always. So this is because uh, in, in other things, in, in other reason that to start the index start with zero. Okay. So let's this uh, start with two and with seven instead of two. Okay. This is the step. Last number. I'm so interested about the types. In the sense, if I divide the float for the integer or vice versa or the real, mm -hmm. uh, which uh, the, the, which type uh, wins? Always is float in Python three. Always is float. Okay. Always. So if I you you in t you can see la that is an integer, but actually when you is an integer at the moment that you operate with another float. In that moment, it converts to a plot. The output okay. always is a plot. Okay. Okay. So you can say Actually, it's a it's a storage like a plot always, but it's shown like an integer oh, okay. for co commodity for. Okay. <coughs> okay. Uh, let's. Okay. Let's create. Uh, okay. Let's. See. What happens? We want to a list. Like that work like index, something that goes from zero to one number, and we don't want to type. We can use a range, okay? So np a range six give you six number starting from zero. You can use this like index, okay? So uh, for example. Oh, okay. Look at this. Uh, yeah, what is the type of this? Let's say let's keep n p a range uh, six. Type n as an array, but time the first element of this array is an integer sixty-four. Okay, but if we divide by three, for example, which is no the second one by three is immediately converted to, into a float. Okay? But this is the integer, divide by three, the result is a float. Okay? Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay, this is interesting. Assume that uh, you have an integer, but you want to convert to floats. Okay? Like this. Uh, for example, and we have seen that R integer. You can convert to float a number like this. Remember? You can convert to float. Remember, N1 was a, an integer, but now we have converted a storage here like a float. Okay? What happens if we want to convert all the array, not one by one? We, we could do this, but and complains. He say, okay, no, I'm, I cannot do this. I can only use a float in one single number. If we want to convert to a float, we, we have to use as type. And as type float. And this is converted to is storage in a different n is the same, but if we want to convert n to float, we have to storage in, in a different one. In the new one, it could be the same name or a different one. Okay? Now n is a float. So a type float or a type integer or look at this. String. Now our strings, okay? So basic operation, 
we can sum, multiply, the division, or concatenate. We can we we can concatenate two arrays, but we have we don't have to sum because this is going to uh, to be a, a mathematical sum. With concatenate, we put together two uh, numpy arrays. For example, we have. Uh, a, and the result is a list, okay? We have this one, and we have uh, this one, okay? We want to concatenate. So we use uh, zeta and p concatenate. We can ask also n p concatenate. What is this for, okay? Join a sequence of array on existing axis. Okay, and the output is an MP array. Mm. Okay, let's try. I don't know if it is going to accept the strings. Yeah. So now it's concatenated. X and N. But Look, it has been converted because NumPy array, you can now mixture strings with number. This is only for list, okay? So it converted everything to the same type, string. So in NumPy, we can have all the elements strings, all the element number, but not mixture. This is for list only. So with, with the concatenation, take x, <coughs> which is our number, text, take n, which are string, and put all together and convert to string. But if where number, for example, let's convert x, no, sorry, n to, again to float. How could do that? And p, uh, uh, sorry, as type uh, float. Okay? Now are back again to float. We have converted from string to float. Let's concatenate uh, like this. X and N. Now are numbers because both are numbers. Okay. So some interesting. Uh, functions. So let's, we have now, let's say, n, okay? We use point, punto, tabulador. And you can see there are a lot of associated functions here. Something that we can do with that, okay? For example, we can uh, ask for the max or for the mean. Of where is located the max? So this is position, okay? Is the index where the max is located? The same for the for the mean, okay? This is the index where the mean. So we can say. Uh, Okay, let's try a different one with this one, for example. Uh, X max, X min, X arg max, where is located, where is located X min. Okay, so for sure this is because it gives the index, this is the maximum. Give the index and the index of this give the maximum. Okay. okay. Mean value we can, for example, x is mean. Okay. X is uh, standard deviation. Zoom. Okay. Uh, median. Median. Median is directing. Is 
是米粮，那奥给很低。米粮，嗯 ，x， 米粮 ，OK。Okay, we can work with uh, uh, two of eight Boolean matrix. Just giving two of eight. Two of eight. Remember, with capital letter the first, no string. Let's build two uh, Boolean uh, arrays. First one a. Right. Let's try this two. True. False. True, okay, and the second one. This is B. Okay. Okay. So we have a list. And we have converted with numpy array and array. So we have A and B, two array of Boolean array contain. So we can multiply multiply I and B, okay? Or we can add together, we can negate A. Oh, mine is one. Uh, no, it's not supported. Oh, this is one. Negate, so it converts first to true. Okay. We can use you can we can use this array. Okay, let's build a new one, a little bit longer. True, true. We can use a boolean array as an index. So we have. This one, we have this one, and we have this array of the same side. We have x, a, and show only the true values. This is true, phase, true, and phase. Okay? Uh, Boolean uh, arrays can be uh, created also and um, operate uh, Boolean operator. For example, let's say uh, mm, mm, let's create an, a new array. Okay, this one with edges. Let's say edges equal say. Mm, So let's put some edges here, 10, 90, okay, so let's create an array looking for uh, edges larger than 50, for example, L equal edges larger than 50, uh, oh sorry, we have to convert an array, a numpy array. Cooperate with that, okay? Now L is a boolean, so we can use with edges, edges L to see la uh, to see what has the the edges larger than fifty, okay? Um, Multi-dimensional arrays. Should we stop or...? or? Sì, meglio così, se non sì. andare, facciamo okay. una, una mezz'ora di pausa. Sì, 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 perfetto. Ok. Dopo. Allora. Questa è la...